It was senior day for UConn men's basketball here in Gampo Pavilion as seniors Kasum Yakwe, Jalen Adams, Eric Cobb, and Terrence Smith were honored today. Despite the injuries to Jalen Adams and Kasum Yakwe, the Huskies put up a valiant battle against the Temple Owls, yet they couldn't maintain their perfect record inside Gampo Pavilion. The Huskies came out of the gate slowly, very slowly. Temple jumped out to a 9-0 lead before UConn finally got a bucket. As the half continued, the offense struggled without Jalen Adams, the Huskies' leader on offense the last four years. Adams is still out with a knee injury. Coming off the bench yet again, Christian Vitale kept UConn in the game, hitting multiple three-pointers as part of a 15-point half in which he shot 4 of 5 from deep. Josh Carlton continued his strong play, throwing down a thunderous dunk as part of an 8.5 rebound half. Turnovers killed UConn momentum in the first though, as they gave it away eight times. The Huskies were finally able to break out of their early half woes in the second, catching fire from deep. The ever-improving chemistry between Josh Carlton and Altry Gilbert peaked again as a pass from the former to the latter gave UConn their first lead of the night at 45 to 43. The back and forth stretch continued through the half as both sides hit big shot after big shot. When Altariq Gilbert went down with a facial injury, UConn lost their de facto leader, their warrior, as Coach Hurley calls them. Hurley had high praise for the heartbeat of his team. You know, when you have a guy with a heart that big and just stands for all the right things and is, isn't about himself, that, that's why he, um, you know, he's, he could be the heartbeat of your team. And, and um, you know, he's such a likable guy, he's such a fun guy to deal with every day because all he does is give you his best. In his void, Temple went full throttle, taking a 65-60 lead with four to go, until a huge steal by Terrence Smith gave way to a Tyler Pauly three-point attempt. Yet, a metaphor for the season, Pauly converted just two of three after he was fouled on that attempt. The Huskies shot a paltry 54% from the line, while Temple cemented their place firmly on the tournament bubble, nailing all their free throws down the stretch and shooting 85% overall from the line, taking a tight one, 78-71. As Coach Hurley left the court, he had a message for the students and for UConn Nation. We got great fans here. I thanked them and I said, uh, you know, when you see us next time, we will look, uh, you know, we're going to look a lot different, and uh, you know, we're going to keep getting better, and you know, just kind of stick with us because we're going to we'll build it back to uh, to what you all deserve. The disappointing end to a promising first season at home for the Huskies, who lost just once here in stores. The Huskies will look for their first road win of the season on Sunday when they travel to East Carolina. From Gamble Pavilion for the last time this 2018-19 season, I'm Noam Watt, UCTV Sports.